Hi, I'm Sonia. And I'm Lee Rudd. And welcome back to Max I Minutes. Today, we are back on campus, and we asked you guys on our Instagram what you wanted to see. So, we got a lot of requests, and we're actually going to do two parts of this video. So, this is part one, where we are on campus. Yep, we're going to be giving you guys a tour of everything that's kind of going on on campus right now, and next time, we're going to be in Westdale. Let's go! Yeah. Okay, so on our first stop, we have the gym, the David Braley Athletic Center, also known as DBAC. And in here, you can find the Pulse, which is the actual like gym. There's like swimming facilities, there are courts, and here is where you would find all the intramurals and stuff that goes on. Um, they also have a booster juice, my favorite booster they juice do on have campus, a booster juice there. better than the one at Musk. So our next stop is the Student Center, also known as Musk, and everyone here talks in abbreviations, so you're going to get used to that. Yeah, so pretty much everything that's in here, you can find a bunch of food places. Personally, I love Booster Juice. I already said that before, but that's okay. In addition to that, we also have a bunch of uh, study spaces at the top. You can kind of see it like through the glass part up there. And yeah, in the basement, before I forget, they also have bubble tea. So if you like Cha time, tea, that's solid. Mm -hmm. And then also the bookstore is here as well. And over here is Mills. <laughs> This is one of the libraries. It's got some very tall study spaces at the top over there. And the higher up you go, the more quiet it gets. So if you need a like silent study and get your stuff done. Six floors for you. So we got a request to show you where the Willy Dog card is. It's currently not here right now for obvious reasons. But, but this is where you find it. Yeah. Right here in front of Musk and Mills. All right, so behind us over here, we have the Science Hub. It's called Burke Science Building, also oh. known as BSB. Yeah, pretty much everything science related. So the McMaster Science Society, a bunch of profs, so, office, they're all centered in this building. So our office is in the basement, B108, and you can find us there. We've got a nice big door, you can't miss it. And then on the third floor, we have the Science Lounge, which is a nice little study space and there's lots of yeah places to study. Yeah, they also have the bio labs up there. They also have other labs that can be utilized. Physics labs. Physics. Physics is in the basement. Physics in the basement, sure. I didn't know that. Oh. We are now at the A.N. Bourne Science Building. No one calls it that, though. It's actually just ABB. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. And also right behind these doors is area that strikes fear into most first years, that's because the chem labs are held here. And the coolest thing about this building, I think, is the periodic table you can actually see. And it's got actual elements, so Literally like the real... every element of the periodic table that can be like... Contained visible. in a little yeah. square. So we are now at the highly requested Health Sciences Library, and I think it was highly requested truly because of this very large window that everyone loves. Um, we actually did a video debating the libraries and what people like the best, so you guys should go check that out if you want more information on what people think the best study spot is on campus. That's about it. Oh, it's also connected, I forgot the most important part. It's also connected right to the hospital. That might not Through more tunnels! That's not the most important part, but that's okay. <laughs> it's an aspect of the building that's important to know. Yes. Window. You know what we forgot though? We got a request to find the best climbing tree on campus and after much deliberation we have settled on this one. And here we see Sonia who is struggling immensely to try and climb the tree that we think is the best climbing tree. 20 minutes later. Ow. Anyways, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Unfortunately, we couldn't get everything in this video, but um, hopefully next time we're going to be checking out Westdale, so stay tuned for that. Also, be sure to check out Tina and Devin's next video. It's their part two for their questions from you guys. And then also, we are going to be releasing a feedback form, so keep an eye out for that. We just want to know what you guys think of our videos and how we can make it better for you. That's it. Bye. Falls out of tree. <laughs>